Well, good morning, boys and girls. We are back here with the pop artist Perry Milo, and who's with me? The Palakids! All right, the Palakids. Again, it's the Palakids. Allie, Jenna, and Leah. Today we're going to do a fabulous paper mache project called Shoes in the City. And I have confiscated these lovely pumps and stylus shoes from my wife Angela's closet. And the kids are going to use some cellu clay and some fast mache, some Elmer's glue. We're going to make an untraditional paper mache mix that we're going to show you how to do. And they're going to start doing their molds. We're going to put that together. And when we come back, we're going to show you the first segment of this amazing paper mache Shoes in the City project where the kids start putting that mold together. And we'll be back with Pallet Kids. Okay, we are back with the Pallet Kids. They are fast at work. We're zooming in, uh, especially on Jenna here. And Jenna, can you tell us what you're doing here quickly on this first step? Well, we're just ripping small pieces off of this and then just folding it in the shoe and folding it on top and tucking it in. Okay, and what is that you're using there? What material is that? Um, Tin foil, maybe? Yeah. Okay, we'll give you a quiz later. And uh, Allie, how's yours coming along? You're using a pump, too? Okay, and there's Jenna. She's using more of a uh, Leah. contempt. Leah, sorry, Leah. <laughs> All right, pal, kids, back to work. Cut. Now you can see the children are using the aluminum foil and actually some blue painters tape to keep the foil around the shoe to create the mold. And after that, we're going to go into some petroleum jelly, some Vaseline to coat that. And then once that is all applied, the paper mache will really pop off beautifully when adhered and dry. Welcome back to the Palakites. What we are doing right now is we are paper macheing our shoe. And we have some paper mache paste and paper towel, er, and we lightly dip it into the paper mache mix. Yeah. And you, you just... I'm going to hold this up for you so we can show the camera. So Allie's wiping off the excess of the paste with her fingers like a scissor, and you can see she's really developing some nice layers on her shoe. And the more layers you have, the thicker you build this. When we go to get this off later, whether cutting it with scissors or by hand, it's going to form a strong mold. And you can see Allie's actually done the entire shoe. So it's going to be a full 3D form when she's done. She's pressing out the, uh, the excess uh, moisture, and she's building this beautifully. And we will be back with Pallet Kids.